Not Stephen. If I knew, I would tell you. Direct strike mixed. We're going to go with the no crash strategy. Oh, I've got a Huntress start. Maybe I should do the Huntresses. Just like Terrific was doing previous game. Basically, we just had a go at this. I got a Crypt Lord as my hero. I had very different units. I did have a Witch Doctor to go with the Spirit Walker, which was nice. I had Mountain Giants as well and Griffin, so I had some really good stuff, so I was taking it off. And then I just disconnected. Reforged things. That's what it was. In before two Huntresses is sent because he skipped his gold mine. We've got 40 seconds till the next gold mine. Ah, it's grunts. Grunts are quite good, aren't they? I think Huntress won't, won't work versus this. He really likes the control of that middle. I'd have to invest a lot to oh, deal with that, wouldn't I? Time. Don't think Rifleman or Triad will help me. So do I just get a hero instead? I think I just have to get a hero instead. I can't see a Huntress doing well against that. Yes, yes. I mean, they're okay, but they won't beat Grunt until you get like a stupid amount of them. And then you're really pinholing yourself. You're interrupting my calculations. What type of custom PvP do you feel is suitable for playing Warcraft currently? Custom PvP? What does that even mean, Basil? What does that even mean? Yes. I'm not really so interested in PvP so much in World of uh, in Warcraft. Don't know if I'm going to have enough gold for another Huntress. I think I will. No, no, no. Not like that. Ah, Lich. Alright, interesting. That's not actually too bad a start. Interesting, don't normally get a witch. Gonna go frost armor. Oh, he's done a lot of damage to the watchtower already, hasn't he? No experience though, Sag. Frost armor's good versus the grunts. Oh gosh, they got a lot of grunts, didn't they? It's obsessed with them. Yeah, this no could work. Job done. He needs to kill one unit, though, right? How have you not killed a unit by that point? How much health have they got? I would have thought he would have killed one. I'm certainly sure it looked like he was, unless he changed target at the last moment. My Some sort of tricky. I've only got one gold miner here. I'm holding back. I'm going like more serious. We, we need to win. He's just going to get air or something. Mass. That mass guard going on. Spirit Walker, maybe. But I need tier 2 for that. So that's 250 gold. That could be another Huntress. Cheeky Orb and Lich. Well, old school. <laughs> Orb of Huam. Maybe. Sadly, I don't think I'm going to be able to afford it. We've got five seconds. More gold is required. More gold is required. Oh, I just got it. No, no, not like that. Let's try it. Feeling cute. Oh, he's got some horrific looking dryads. My gosh. Some blood skin dryads. I knew you were going to do that. 
<laughs> what about this guy? One hit would have done nicely there. I knew he was going to do that. Well, I'm not even sure to get Spirit Walker. If he's got Dryads, he might just remove. I feel like you just got to keep massing. Or we get some Riflemen just to do deeps from behind. Depends if their DPS is better. It's kind of the same. They're a bit cheaper, though. It's a bit more, really. Of course, it's piercing against heavy armor, which isn't that bad. Dryad Dot does more. I'll try some Dryad here. They can help slow down the grunts. And their attack. Wow. Double heroes stacked up here. We're all going to be stacked up, apart from that one. I don't think we can save the Naga Sea Bitch in time, can we? Man, I've sacrificed so much gold. Gold love. You'd think Terrific would have like five gold mines or something. It's because he skips it. Oh, I saved the Dark Naga Sea Bitch. You're welcome. This will hurt me a bit, though, to be honest. I'll have it up in no time. Hi. Next trips. I'm Dane. Are we being invaded? Glad. Is there trouble? You're interrupting my calculations. I will just basically make as many drives as he kind of has. For now. Not so sure about my end game stuff, to be honest with you. Don't have a priest, I don't have like obsidian statue. Got one there though. They got the double hero stacked up again. The obsidian statue is healing for miles back, but it's not a catch of these. Oh, there we go. Obsidian statue is pretty insane in this because it basically bounces both the uh, the heals and the mana. Terrific still hasn't got a hero yet. It's time for me to get level 2. I've gone greedy with the third gold mine. There's a debate whether I should do it at all, but that's it. If I'm going to do it, I'm either just totally not going to do it, or I'm going to do it now. I chose now. Whee, level 2. We've got a bit of a hero army here. Frost armor, boys. Get some deals and knowledge. It'd be kind of funny to get the Lich, like, multiple fast attack speed items just to hear the Huam go off more often. I think you can go wrong with just more dryers, to be honest. I just think they're really good units. Dryad spam. Got a big push on their base, actually. some damage. My hero doesn't come out again because he's still over here. Still fighting a good fight. Yeah, the hero's... He's going along and suddenly... 
I don't think I'm going to get 500 gold. Maybe. we got 40 seconds to get 500 gold. Maybe, maybe. Every 20 seconds, 140 gold. Let's see, you've got, you've got another 20 seconds now. Yeah, 140 gold from this point isn't going to be enough. 340. You'll have like 420 gold, maybe, by the uh, 30 second mark. Kodo is pretty nice. I might go tier 3, work towards the Molishers. See, look at the gold. 30 seconds, 425 there, or 423. So that's about right in my head mathematics. I saw a video of like these uh, Indian ladies doing calculus with these students, and they're like going like this to do like mental abacus. I'm pretty sure that's not the right word for it. <laughs> Whatever the hell. Calculus, but it's like abacus. That's the one. I remember Abacus, but I only did that in like primary school or something. But they could count very high numbers. Those bears aren't kicking off properly yet. He's got Shadow Hunter. Right. Here comes the Lich. We're going to join up with our fellow heroes. Priests. It does look strong, to be honest. Naga Sea Bitch, just about gonna hang in there. Level 5 Dark Ranger. Let's go second hero. That impale. Hitting nothing. Time to get level four. Grunts are marching in, the backup priests. So I have a plus three to all stats or just a bit more armor. Since it's gonna affect other units, I'll just do the armor. Right. Blood mage. Mm. Okay, let's do a flaming strike. Tech up. And I'll work towards demolishers. Alchemist is a good hero. Dark Mega's got crazy spam of ghouls. Got to level 3 now on the Alchemist. Flame strength? That's not bad flame strength. 300 gold for a demolition. Do another flame strike for luck. <laughs> Quite a strong push back. Don't know whether to get some knights, maybe just to, a little bit of tank engine. Yeah, I know. I'm feeling like I need front line. Elf would have thought of something better. I really want to just go demolish this, but yes, yes. Yes. Command me. Okay. All the king. I walk in shadow. I think we're gonna lose that guard too. Probably gonna lose my army as well, to be honest, because they got quite a barrel. Uh, I don't know, actually. Dark. Is it Dark Mega? It's hanging in there. Might go for a demolisher. Huh? Yeah, it's Dark Mega. He's doing quite well. He will fall, but he did well for a time being there. I'm gonna step in now. I won't be the one to defend this. I'll do what I can. They'll probably kill that and then I have to fight out in the open.
get that alchemist down. Get him out of here. It's good that you can see the um, enemy times as well. So if you're looking at it when you kill that alchemist, he's still got 40 seconds left, so he's fine. Time for me to fall down. They got one hell of a barrel roll. Soaps up. He's got the priest. So that's really good. Just needs to hang in there a little bit. Blade Master. And he's already got two keggers gem of health. Blade Master Imba. Turn around. Rifleman dealing with the dryads. Good experience with the Blade Master. It's a really good time for him to basically come out. He gets to soak that up. I haven't got oil for the pulp yet. Um, yeah. I should do. Maybe when we... Because um, we can do health on the knights, but I've only got a couple. So. 150 gold for like... Yeah, like an extra 150 health. It's not even that, probably. It's 30 health. <laughs> it wouldn't be worth it at the moment. Now they've got priests, I can try a fairy dragon or something. The heroes are all back again ready to join up and do battle once again. Sends a bolt of mana. Or sight. I don't know which one. He doesn't siphon to his friendly allies, does he? He just takes it from enemies. If he takes it from enemies, he's more likely to walk in front and try to mana drain and then get himself killed, so I think I'll do mana transfer for now. Nothing quite like a lich with all the corruption. We've got a pretty big army now, especially with those priests. Keeping so much alive in the obsidian statues. I'll get some spirit walkers, actually. Just so this can be even more meme Did you steal that? You stole a Kodo now for the, uh, the army. Ghouls are quite funny, but I feel like the downside here would be they steal a lot of priest heals. It's not so valuable on the ghouls. you got spirit walkers as well, I see. Well, let's have some more, I suppose. And I'll get that burning oil. And a bit more damage. What the hell is that? <laughs> What is a wyvern or something? It looks so weird when it's like looking like that. Look at these little hands as well. Do canaries have hands? They don't have hands, do they? Looks like an abomination. Big damage. Right. Ooh, frost worms. That's so good. Necromancers as well. Obsidian statue would have been the icing on the cake here, I think. Because that would give both health and mana back. I don't know. Meat wagon's pretty good with the um, the disease cloud. Obsidian statue is nice. Rifleman, not too bad. Witch doctor over here. 
Griffin Rider. Yeah, just go Witch Doctor, Spirit Walker, Mass Griffin Rider. Just go f flat out angry noob mode. What's he built? Two giant footmen. He likes starting off with those early units. Don't know if I have anything that counts as footmen, really. So. Hero. A hero to counter the footman is what I'm going to go. If I see something very specific that I have that would be good against this footman, then maybe I'll build it instead of going for the hero, the gold mine into the hero, but I don't really. The skins are so good. Wow, Chad Rifleman. You're interrupting my calculations. I didn't build a hero in time. I, f I was too busy watching the epic fight. <laughs> I missed my hero timing. Uh, it's a bit of a nuisance. I might do something hyper greedy then. Whenever I make a mistake, I tend to go double down. I got 50 seconds to wait for the next gold mine there, so I'd still have the money for it. I'll have it up in no time. You want me to do what? You never know. It could end up being a, a benefit for missing your hero. Oh wow, Alchemist, that's so good. Because if he spawned there, it might have been bad for him. Although he's always going to die anyway. There's no way he's going to live long enough for that 90 seconds to pop and then he'd still have to stick around. What? Did someone just get a hero? Yeah. Does it spawn it there then? Maybe that's what it does. It could be worth just buying items for our alchemist. Pure life. Because, I mean, even if I build units, I don't think it's going to do much right now. No, no, no. Not like that. Let me do it. I'll see what they got. The next army is the one I'm going to be fighting against. But I won't be able to see it. Because Soap's going to be dead before that point. Better to fight against the ghouls than Ufa. Apparently not. Apparently someone is better. Don't use your acid bomb, don't use your acid bomb. Okay. I wasn't gonna be quick enough to turn it off. Interesting. Alchemist needs a bit of armor actually. He's not using acid bomb though. You're gonna make it harder for yourself not using acid bomb. I'll take the experience. That's going to be a pretty big experience, probably. I'll have it up in no I could make the dryads then. The scummy dryad mass. Wow. Oh, it doesn't work against them. That's okay, the drives will work. They're pretty versatile units, you know. They got the slow they slow your enemy's attack speed down with their attacks. They can do some good piercing damage. Ranged. I think we've got some good heroes. What do you want? 
Try it, should be good here. I'd say I hard counter that, to be honest. Alchemist is just big and tanky. He doesn't have the protection armor though, but at the moment it doesn't look like he needs it that much. Flat health is still doing good. I'm not tempted to get, if you're going to get an aura, you could get that as well as the ring of protection. He only needs some armor though. Or if you could just get him stats. But his abilities are good, so I can't really put points into stats either. Because agility equals armor. You think health is still better. Yeah, that's the funny thing, isn't it? In a way. He, he might get the armor eventually. Just pure flat health. Still. That's a good value. Alchemist is everything. He does good damage. He's just tanky. He does good damage with the acid bomb as well. Not just auto to his head. Might get heals from the Paladin when we group up anyway. So yeah, I could get an armor item actually. Because that make the value from the Paladin heals better. Go man, go. He's still only level 1 though. I feel like he's done well, but he's still level 1 somehow. You want to get him level 6 as fast as possible, really? Because he's going to get gold back, right? Yeah, I actually just might get him both of these. Because that way I've got, an, I've got an aura for the team. The Lion Horn aura is kind of a shit one, but it works with him. And it will still benefit the team. Although I shouldn't have done that. Because I just remember we got Paladin. So, uh. I assume it doesn't stack with the Paladin. Does not stack. Okay. You, don't, you can sell that, right? I don't know if I got all my gold back because technically, right? I did buy that before he spawned, but I think it looks like you don't. You can't. You can do that with units in this game. You lost 25%. I'll have to get that back with the uh, transmute then, won't I? Yeah, you can build units, and if you sell them before the spawn, then you get all your money back. But it doesn't work with items, which is unfortunate. In an ideal world, it would do, because technically I haven't used the item yet. I'm not on the field yet. So plus 10 armor. There's only so much that man can handle, though. We know that... I think both the Hippogriffs and Fly Machines are kind of jank though, aren't they? They're so cheap though, Hippogriffs, it's kind of tempting to try them. They're like crazy cheap. Oh yeah, no, no, you're right actually. Destroyers would actually do a really good job. 
Well, I think that's what Terrific might have been doing. Yeah, Destroyer would be a good, nice way to take rid of, uh, take out some of that buff edge. And maybe get a knight to help tank a little bit alongside my hero. Although he's already got all that armor, so he really shouldn't. They just need to make sure they, they don't um, have bloodlust off, because that bloodlust equals damage. Seems like they're all doing the same thing. Shaman and Hippogriff riders. Bit of a snowball going there. What do you want? How does that get approved? I'm not sure really. Yeah, I guess knights, because knights can help versus the mountain giants. Job's done. What? Job's done. Should be quite good for me. How could you not have Lord Garethos? Have it up in no time. Yes, yes, I'm already on. Job's done. Well, what are you waiting for? Looks like they start with Thunder in Blaze, so they get that by default. More gold is required. Yeah, you, you're not messing around. Got a little Garifoss on the battlefield. This is going to end badly for them. Need a frost armor now. That was a bloody good breath of fire. Just hit everything. Soaks up all of that experience. some more upgrades. Again with the armor. Stacking up my armor. Look at that. Fire Lord. It's just feeding my destroyers. That was a bit unfortunate to get Fireball. Fry's got a pretty good well-rounded army though. He's adapting.
panda's gonna like just crush it again. I don't want to get some archers, you know, just as extra DPS line from behind. It's like a switch back to tier one. But I can see some value in it, to be honest with you. Especially since I'm against a lot of range here as well. Panda down. We're going to redeem the panda. Like the video if you haven't done so already. However many minutes we are into this game. It's time. Those archers DPSing. Looks like they need a bit more range. Yeah, if you donate to me, then it saves a panda's life somewhere in the world. I think that's how it goes. I think I've just got an uh, acid bomb off there just before I went out. Necros can be chucked in. I've really only got the one cross one, but can chuck a few necros into the mix. I don't think it would make a, a negative impact. Level six panda. Ooh, ooh, big hits here. Too hard for him to lift up his hammer. Time to cape take care. I still got. Where's my level six? Let's go, Fry. You might get level 6 next time. Could go for a second hero. He's pretty much almost guaranteed to get level 6. No, no, no. Not like that. Are we being invaded? Do... I'm gonna try. Because no you the the later the game you go. The more units there are in the field, the more experience that each of those units is worth. You're interrupting my calculations. I hate working with these people. Yeah, I know. It sucks. You're working with a bunch of elves and undead. Research. Ooh, give him something to do. See if this alchemist can get level six. It's gonna be close. The enemy armies, there's a few soft ones for me to soak up experience with. It might not be enough for level six though. It's close. I 
think you'll get it next time, for sure. Gonna have to give that Mount King some healing, though. Those healing wards are a bit nasty, though, because they, uh, they don't get taken out by my destroyers or my dryads. And it, it kind of keeps these units alive. I soften them up, but I don't really get any kills for the alchemist there. A bit too late. Band is crazy on this. Research complete. He's too far forward. Alright, next time is I like, guarantee, man. He's so far forward. May as well get some big boys. Some more frost or something. for that music. So many hippo riders. We think we'd have to build like pure anti-air, but we still have built proper anti-air yet. Footman spam. Yeah, I could upgrade the range, can I? I think I already have upgraded the archer range. Will I be able to get level six? I didn't think it was gonna take this long. Goddamn Mount King! Oh, there's no way. There's no way. It just sits there. It's like it's rigged now at this point. That's not in the blueprints. Job's done. I guess I should have waited just a little longer. Honestly, I felt like even if I didn't get level six at that time that I built now. I felt like I was definitely going to get to the next one after. It's it just kind of the, the way the fights have gone, the way he's sort of... He walked too far forward on one of those ones, so he basically got himself killed almost immediately. So that was like a dead turn. I mean, it is basically impossible for him to not get level 6 now. It's, like, it's, it's just impossible now. I want to use my... Uh, Transmute on those mountain giants. Look at the gold. We're going to see how much gold we get. Is he going to be able to use it in time now? That's the question. Before I get killed. Right. 276 gold, 208 gold. 
I don't know if he's used it yet. I don't think he's used it. I didn't see the gold go up. Is he going to use it? I'm looking at the gold more than I'm looking at him. You going to use it, buddy? No? Don't want to use it? Oh my gosh. It only costs 50 mana as well. <laughs> Feel free to spam it. This alchemist, he's a paid actor. He's fighting for the enemy team, I think, at this point. It's like a boxer. You could disable all of these abilities and then activate them once he's used transmit. He's left it too late to get the gold. Their pushback is quite strong here. Yeah. Bonkers action. I'm gonna get another destroyer. They've got so many um buffs on their team, it's crazy, isn't it? I think you just have to make a lot of destroyers as well. Let's go Alchemist. Use it yet? I still haven't seen it. I'm gonna have to turn his ability on. Bro, do you actually? Let me turn it off and then turn it on. It's a dead ability. He's not using it. I'm not seeing it. I'm, at least I'm not seeing the gold go up. Did I? Oh, okay, fair enough. As long as you use it. Tanks are good. This is a good pushback here. Yeah. No I can get gyros. Although, then again, they got tanks actually. I'll just get mortar teams because that can help for the push against their base. Doesn't help if we don't get to push it against their base though. Well, it does. It still works against all these units. Go Garifoss. I'm holy Garifoss. Mount King's level 3. Lots of experience for him to soak up. I should probably get aura items. I got Garifoss voice line. Welcome to Free For All. The game where everyone is a fucking lucker. Except for you. Not yet. No, I have a Paladin and an Archmage. Okay. And do we have a Kodo? Someone else can get Flute of Accuracy. I've got a lot of range units, but not... Well, actually, I have got a lot of range units. I could get Flute of Accuracy. I've got m way more range units than anything else. So, yeah, it's just the knights that aren't ranged. Feeling Flute.
Wow, blizzards. And the volcano. Ooh. Castle's gonna go down. Ah. Call it there. GG. Whoa, look at soap. That panda was insane value. Look at the damage. It's crazy. And as much damage as me and Dark Mega combined. That score. <laughs> He's like miles ahead there. That panda was like knocking off some insane breath of fires. And he kind of turned up at the right time when like so many of the enemy were ready to be killed sort of thing. So he was like there to just like dominate every time he landed on the board. Very good job. Another round? I'll put it on your tab. <laughs>